just wanted to share with you all another little area of my garden. It's over on the left hillside. It's where I have some of my watermelons growing. And I have three watermelon hills. I've got, of course, my big sunflowers. And I had some corn. But at each, I guess, watermelon area, I planted some marigolds. But I also planted some of these little guys. And they're called a painted daisy. And they have an official name that starts with a T. And I cannot pronounce it. Um, but they look kind of like a daisy. But they are different colors. And... I just love those. In the backdrop, you see some calabarcoa spilling over the bed back there that's still pretty in pink. But I have some in different colors here. But that's just one of my little um, areas of painted daisies. And I'll show you these here are just beginning to start to bloom they're about to pop open those there and there's one that's almost open and this area down here see there's watermelons hiding <laughs> i know where to find them and this little area right here i just love them so i hope that they bring you some joy and cheer today because they sure do me so this is something new. I did some of these. They were supposed to be um, supposed to come back every year, which I love, and it's supposed to help keep uh, pests away and things like that. But they are just adorable. So painted daisy. That might be something you want to add to your garden next year. All these marigolds I planted, and they um, they just do so well. You see all the little orange dotted across through there's all marigolds so and i've got a little wildflower area under the um sunflowers here and i've got some different wildflowers growing there so all right y'all have a blessed day